that sun, man. It's, it's so amazingly bright. It's literally like a summer day. But the thing about the weather this time of year, literally the last week in August, it's going to be a burr month. Is it could be beautiful, sunny, not a cloud in the sky today, and rainy for the next three days. So it's always a crapshoot, but you got to roll the dice. Otherwise, you don't get to be in the game, yo. One for the boys back home. <laughs> Welcome to paradise. You know, it is Art. more fun in the Philippines, despite the fact that the lockdown, GCQ, all this craziness, and border checks and oh man I, I can't even begin to get into telling you how crazy it's been just to get up here a lot of perseverance knowing the right people getting the right paperwork you can make it happen they say you need a face mask to be on the beach but there's no one here I don't think I will comply. Cloudscape. Oh, no. yeah. Every time low tide, it's easy for you to catch a crab and fish. Like this. Well, I have the name of Fish are jumping like crazy. Man. We call it Suwaki in Tuyong. This is Yeah. And the red one and this one. Some little freaking sea urchins, man. Gotta watch your step out here. Gotta watch your step. Ihi hi ka ba? Bawal umehi dito. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if you would call it a cool house on the beach. I mean, it's kind of cool. It's definitely patchwork. But geez, it's right on the beach, man. Who needs AC and Wi Fi, right? Oh, this in the tree here? No, no, no. That one. <laughs> What's that one? I don't know. I forgot the this one. No, like, this one. like this baby. Uh, Hold on. The big one. Like this, but it's too small. Oh, they're almonds. This is not almond. So what you have to do is you have to do it like this. I'm pretty darn sure there's the almonds. You have to do it like this. Baby. No, maybe they're not. So this, this is it's not yet. So this one is dry, but sometimes it's not good already. So it's supposed to be like this, but it's supposed to be good, but it's not good. Yeah, the beach house is a super awesome private spread. We rented all three floors, so we've got the whole thing to ourselves. Normally this time of day would be high tide, but uh, it's different. Now, so. <laughs> Man with his meat. Oh. You either have that little great big one over here in the Philippines, like this big. All right, sunset on La Union Beach. Where's 
by the sea. Right. Oh my god, welcome to the Philippines. The German beer garden here in La Union. We're a party of six, but we get three separate tables one meter apart because of social distancing. Really great opportunity for a study of shadow and light today in these tidal pools here in La Union. It's a really perfect time of day to get like the reflections of the clouds in the water and the reflections of the rocks in the water. And there's this separation of still water and surf water and finding these blending elements between where the surf pushes the water to ripple a little bit out by where it's breaking and how that creates a different effect in the reflections from the skies and the rocks as opposed to the Thanks so much still for reflections. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up. It's been a really rewarding, focused, quiet, like a tune sort of experience for me here. Grateful, thankful. It's amazing to get out of the metro. I mean, me, like 12 million other people, have been pretty much locked down in Manila for months. And except for the very, very few occasions where I've been able to get a break from that stricter quarantine mode, this is the first time I've been away for more than four days, so I'm really making the most of it. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe for more content from Metro Manila, Philippines.